Hello everyone and welcome to a new sound design tutorial. Today we're going to learn how to create an 808 style sound in Biotech 3, an essential element in genres like trap, hip hop, and electronic music. The 808 has two key components, a deep sub bass and a percussive envelope that simulates an initial punch. First, we start by selecting a clean patch to work from scratch. Next, we'll go to oscillator one and use the default sine wave. Expand the view and lower it by one octave. We can use the shape parameter to generate some extra harmonic content. Somewhere between three and 5% will do. Now let's shape the amplitude envelope to create that characteristic 808 punch. Navigate to envelope four and set a fast attack of around 1.5 milliseconds for an immediate start. Then set the decay to around one second, the sustain to zero, and the release to around one second so the sound fades out gradually. Select the Envelope 1-2 tab and click on the Envelope 1 button to enter a sign mode. We'll assign Envelope 1 to the pitch parameter of Oscillator 1. A modulation amount of around 24 semitones will be enough. To make the pitch drop quickly from a sharp start, we'll configure the envelope with a very short attack, around 1.8 milliseconds, a decay of around 100 milliseconds. Sustain at zero, and release at around 40 milliseconds. Next, I'll use the drive module to saturate the sound with a medium distortion. The aim is to enhance the resonances a touch while making the sound more compact. Let's push the drive to around 15% and see how it sounds. Perfect. Now we'll expand the FX section to add another distortion. This time we'll select a hard type to give the sound a growling character. We'll aim for a good balance with the drive, somewhere between 10 and 20%. Let's try it out. I'll add a touch of reverb in effect slot four to make it sound more natural. I'll set a decay of three or four seconds and cut the low frequencies to avoid a buildup in the bass range. Let's slowly increase the mix and take a listen. That will do. Now let's close the effects section and go to filter one. Here, we load a ladder low pass 24 filter and bring the resonance and FM parameters right down. We'll set the cutoff frequency around 1400 Hertz, which will give the sound more clarity and an extra punch. Finally, we'll navigate to the common module and set the sound to mono so that notes don't overlap. Then we'll enable Glide to give the sound that typical pitch sliding effect. A value of around 400 milliseconds should be sufficient. And there you have it, an 808 style sound created from scratch in Biotech 3. See you in the next tutorial. 